Hello, everybody. Welcome back to CSC. Steve here with another video. And today, uh, it's going to be a short one. I wanted to uh, talk about something that somebody asked me the other day. And uh, they asked me what I thought about all of the kneeling going on, mostly by uh, white folks, white individuals directed at black people, African Americans. And I was asked what I thought about it. And of course, all of this kneeling and things like that <clears throat> are a result of uh, what happened to uh, Mr. Floyd a few weeks ago and all of the uh, unrest and protests and riots and a whole host of things that have happened uh, since that with this re- awakening of uh, the race wars and the race issues that are supposedly so ingrained and deep in America that uh, white people feel like they have to kneel down and, and apologize to uh, black folks for all of the past wrongs, perceived wrongs, uh, thoughts, you know, you name it, that's all thrown in there. And these white individuals feel guilty about the things that have happened and they're kneeling. So I was asked, how do I feel about that? And my honest feeling about it is that uh, I'm totally against it. I would not let anyone kneel to me. I would not let anyone even think about it because well I'll give you a couple of reasons why I don't I don't feel that is right the first one being that we and when I say we I mean every human being every man woman child that God has created we are in equal fitting footing we are in the same boat we have the same uh, proclivities. We have the same issues that we deal with internally and we're all equal. So I would not let anyone white, black, Asian, whatever race, whatever ethnicity, whatever nationality you are, it doesn't matter. I would not let anyone kneel in front of me. The second reason why I would not let anyone kneel to me or neither would I kneel to anyone else for that matter is the fact that there is only one person in this universe who we need to and should be kneeling to. God is who I kneel to and that is who we all should be kneeling to. More specifically, Jesus Christ. Now listen to this. And this is in uh, Philippians 2. Verse 9 and 10 in the New Testament. Therefore, God has highly exalted him and bestowed on him the name that is above every name, so that at the name of Jesus, every knee should bow in heaven and on earth and under the earth, and every tongue confess that Jesus Christ is Lord to the glory of God the Father. So that is the only person that all of us should be kneeling to. And when I see these individuals, these white individuals kneeling in front of the black uh, people, I do not hear those words coming out of their mouth that God has given a name above all names and that at that name that we should all be kneeling to. So unless we are all kneeling together, black, white, brown, whatever your race, ethnicity, or, you know, whatever condition you might be in, unless we are all kneeling down together to worship our Lord and Savior, then there will be nobody kneeling to me as a man. So unless we, we can either stand together in unity and in fellowship and in grace and work things out and reconcile things with each other, or we can kneel together in prayer 
to the name that is above every name. So beside those those two things, I would never let anybody kneel to me. So that's my take on it. God bless you. Thank you for listening. Please do subscribe to our channel. If you have a thought that is different from mine, please do leave it in the comments field. Feel free to ask me any question you like. Feel free to engage with the channel. But please do hit the bell icon. Give us a thumbs up. And hopefully you have uh, you now fully understand my position on kneeling. And I'd like to hear yours. So God bless you. See you next time.